this morning, though. Coach Kyle Sniatecki here to <laughs> talk about an upcoming soccer camp that your kids can get involved with. Coach, yes. good to see you. Thanks for coming in. Yeah, thank you yeah. for having me. Sure thing. Well, Coach, okay, uh, you've played soccer for Marshall. You help coach at Marshall. You have your own <coughs> camps. Uh, you you really like soccer. You know soccer. a thing or two. I, you know your I do. I'm, I'm very passionate about yes. it. Yes, and you have a camp coming up next week uh, with the YMCA, so we want to hear all about it. But, I mean, I guess kind of talk about why has soccer just been your lifelong thing? Yeah. So it first started when I was six and uh -huh. um, just had a, a real love for the game. An older brother that kind of, you know, pushed me and encouraged uh -huh. me. And, you know, one thing led to another. You just, you're on teams and, you know, you build relationships with teammates and coaches yeah. and um, just the game's given me a lot and given me a lot of opportunity. Obviously brought me to here to Huntington, mm -hmm. West Virginia. So mm -hmm. just want to continue to give back and, and do that for the kids here as well. Mm -hmm. well and so with this camp, what do you, what do you yeah. notice as far as the skills that they gain or the changes that you yeah. see in them? Maybe not even just from the sport, but just at them within their growth. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I, I think ultimately, right, we, we want to try to give them skills and, and development, you know, of mm -hmm. the game, but more importantly, just, you know, providing an environment that they can have fun, right. um, that they can, you know, play with other kids, maybe meet somebody new um, uh -huh. that they, they haven't been around. So I'm um, just, just excited for it, you know, thankful for the, the Y to, to partner with me and, and provide more opportunities for this community. Oh, that is great. And we're looking at some footage here. Is this from one of your camps? <clears throat> oh, yeah, yeah. This is um, stuff at the, the Hit Center. Uh -huh. So um, that's where I do most of my training inside at the Hit Center. So again, just different skills trainings, um, private instruction, small group instruction. Um, <clears throat> but it'll, it'll be nice to, to be with a, a different entity here with the, the YMCA here in town. Because usually I do stuff with uh, the Ashland YMCA. Uh -huh. So it's nice to, to be able to do something here in Huntington. And do you, do you work with them more on like a group level? or? Because every child learns differently, mm -hmm. and I'm sure they're at, at different levels within yeah, so um, their playing. Yeah, so it depends. Um, you know, obviously, I, I try to tailor a, a plan that, mm -hmm. that fits for, for that player specifically. Um, but, you know, obviously, once they advance and, mm -hmm. and they move on with their skills, then we try to put them in a group setting to, to kind of give them different pictures and situations uh -huh. that they have to deal with on the field. Oh, that's great. Looks like a lot of fast footwork, too. <laughs> right? Got to be quick on your Fancy feet. Fancy feet. Yeah. <laughs> now, the camp, it's next week with the YMCA. You're... You you know, even working with real little ones, what, yep. six years old? Yep, as young as, young uh -huh. as six, yep. So they'll, they'll, there'll be other um, coaches there on, on staff uh -huh. to, to help me. So we kind of break those um, in groups based on ages and, mm -hmm. and skill development. So, you know, everyone's kind of specific yeah. with the, what they need. Never too young to start soccer? Never never too young. Uh -huh. Never too young. But how, yeah. how long is your camp lasting and how do parents get their, their kids signed up for So it? it's, yeah. it's three days. So it's Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, 8 to 10 in the morning. Okay. Um, and you can go uh, directly to the YMCA website, uh, and there's a, a little blurb, and there's a registration that you can can go on right from there. So okay. it's it's pretty easy for them, and um, you know, obviously, you can you can call the YMCA directly as well as if you have if you have any questions. Okay. Now, what, what age did you start playing though, Kyle? Yeah. I'm, I'm I, I so I, I I guess. Uh, Six was when I really uh -huh. yeah. did organized stuff. But of course, with having an older brother, you know, you could be out in the backyard. Yeah, and there was yeah. always six, a game six, going on in the Six yard. was, yeah, do six you, was uh -huh. the... But do you kind of see yourself in, in these kids when they come yeah, out to the camp? I, do you see a young Kyle that I, 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 had I those dreams right? of playing? Yeah, and, I yeah. think, and I think that's the exciting part, right? You see some of these kids and they, they're just enjoying it. They're smiling and, you know, they're competing and they're just, again, learning those, mm -hmm. those skills, not only right. of soccer, but just life right interacting yeah, good exercise with person. exactly physical you know, fitness as well we're, we're trying to encourage kids to be more active and what better way to do it than Start running around healthy you habits know, early kicking mm -hmm. a ball yeah. that and kind of a thing it's a perfect opportunity right parents can get their kids out of the house for a little bit a little <laughs> bit longer before school starts so yeah. so it's good well, we're watching this fancy footwork, and I'm wondering if this is something you could teach us. So, oh well, boy, <laughs> here we go. Uh, why don't we head over to the other uh, okay. part of our studio? <laughs> now, no guarantees that we can do what Kyle does, but I mean, he does work with six-year-olds, so we'll, we'll see what. You know, I'm what you can full transparent. This is a parent. I've I've never played soccer. I haven't either. That was, <laughs> So you're truly, you're truly teaching newbies yes. here. <laughs> so what well, would be a basic skill? Well, see, it's hard. You, you guys don't have, you don't have There's our excuse. There's our excuse. Yeah. No, but I mean, we just, have a different kind of cleat. Just yeah. some, just some basic stuff, right? Okay. And different. Ball, I call it ball manipulation, right? Okay. So just being able to to use different parts of your foot, bottom, inside, outside. So those are, are different things that we'll do. Obviously, based on the age, right? You got oh my just different little footwork that you can do. 
Okay, even, you know, little juggling skills. Oh, that's what I want to learn. So these, these are different things, right? How to strike a ball, passing, um, all things that we'll, we'll go over in the camp and things that you can do on, okay. at home as well. All right. You did something really fast yeah, here. Yeah, there you go. In, Hard to do. In yeah. heels. Man, look at you guys, Susan. That's yeah. Can I make it juggle off my foot? There. That's about <laughs> as good as it goes. <laughs> so, yeah, and then obviously just different parts of your body, thigh, oh, head. Okay, okay. Yeah. i so got to try the knee one, too. Okay, yeah, that was see, a there you better, go. maybe. There you go. There you go. <laughs> now, what did you say? How to head a ball? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. So with, with go for it, Taylor. Forehead, there, there we you go. go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. <laughs> Coach, you've got uh, your work cut out for you when you work with us. <laughs> right? Yeah. He's like, listen, I we, think the we, kids need, are we need easy. more than three days of camp. <laughs> well, Kyle, let's remind everyone, though, um, yeah. because this is going to be great. I think the kids are going to walk away with um, not just learning about soccer, but some great life lessons, too. Mm -hmm. When yep. is this camp coming up? How do they get signed up? So it's it's next Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, mm -hmm. um, and 8 to 10 a.m. Um, yep. at the Huntington YMCA, the Kennedy Center, and they can sign up directly online um, at the YMCA website. Making it uh, very easy easy there and who knows I mean they start out at six they could be a national champion uh, and coaching playing for college all that kind of thing you never know where that that camp might lead them to right. right I think this is going to start um, really encouraging them to, to uh -huh. think about where they could go with with soccer and I love that you said that you started at that young age and now you're trying to work with them to uh -huh. to get them to that next that next level wherever yep. it may be for them yep well, thank you so much for stopping by, and uh, good luck next week. I know you're going to have fun with them, but you've got a busy summer. You've got lots more camps mm -hmm. coming up, too. Yep, yep, but I'm looking forward to next week. It should be good. Excellent. Good stuff. Thanks for coming yeah. in, Kyle. Good right. to see you. Thank, thank you. you.